I've been exercising my entire adult life and I've never encountered such a radical innovation as blood flow restriction training. And I've thankfully been able to snag one of the leading experts in the country and go deep with him and providing you with all the specific details you need, not only to understand it, but to use it so you can radically upgrade your health. It was almost too good to be true. To get strength or hypertrophy in four to six weeks was just like, there's no way. Physiologically, that's impossible. And to not be causing muscle damage associated with that. So I was a, I was a very big skeptic, to say the least, when I started. What I like to tell people is that we are tricking your brain and your body into thinking that it's doing high intensity exercise, yet we're just doing low intensity exercise. So if you look, you can even see behind me some of the modalities that I use in my clinic. I'm using resistance tubing and resistance bands, and I'm using dumbbells no heavier than about 20 pounds. And I'm able to take these light weights, apply uh, something to occlude the blood flow, and allowing patients' bodies to think that they're doing very high intensity exercise when they're not. The advantage to this is that I don't cause any damage to the tissue if I do it appropriately. Whereas normal exercise training at high intensity does. These patients can't cause more damage to their tissue because they're already injured. And so we use the same exercises that we do in rehab, very light load, but we're able to mimic high intensity exercise, which outside of the physiology that occurs is really the game changer. That's what allows us to see these these quick um, adaptations.